right there. That. That's the Chevrolet bow tie. That's where the emblem went on that radiator shell. More or less complete. Pretty rusted out. But you know what? Things are getting harder and harder to find. Maybe next trip up we'll uh, collect some of these things. If you look real careful, the untrained eye is just a bunch of garbage in the woods here. But if you look real careful now, what do you see? It's a rear fender but for some old car. Well, we're going to go down in there and check out the parts. Now here's what happens every spring. Here, let me back up. Every spring you get the water coming off the backs of the fields from the melting snow. It comes down through the gully here. And these little car parts just keep getting buried and washed under more and more all the time. That's not just any old piece of junk. That's a rear fender. Come back down here. Another piece of a fender sticking up out of the moss and the leaves. And another one. If I remember correctly, 15 years ago or so, I pulled a cowl section out of here that was still here. At first it. look, you'd say that looks like, well, it's probably the back end of a touring car. But closer inspection again. Come down, you see the screws top of the body line. There's a screw right there. Look at that. Another one right there. This is more likely the rear quarter panel of a sedan. And that fender there probably came off of it as well. Let's see if we can fit that piece on there. Okay, there's a fender that I have picked up up the hill a little bit. Looks like it probably went on there. And that fender there came off the other side. They're a matching pair. But I want you to look at this trailer. This trailer is made out of the frame an old car and I have my guesses that's probably Model T because of the rear cross member still being in place. See that? Let me get down here so you can see that thing. <laughs> was a transverse leaf spring on those one up inside that hump. Yep, all kinds of old things we find laying around. Part of the headlight bracket on there, fender bracket as well. This is a, I think was originally set up to be a composting bin. But if you look at the base of it, the louvers. It's a hood side off of an old yeah. car. There's the handle that you lifted it with. The latch cogs still there. Brought you back here because here not only do we have the hood side which is in really good shape but we have the hood top. Remember the uh, Model T frame that had been made into a wagon? This here is the front axle off of Model, Model T. And uh, right there is the old spring perch. Still attached. Where the transverse spring would have mounted. And that's where the kingpins would have gone. Uncle Harry obviously was using it for something else. That, see? Still in 
pretty good shape.